Why does this room smell like fried chicken? The kids are gonna be staying on the wall, so we're packing on plenty of treats. Hoo <laughs> hoo, now here. When did we get these in? Probably not the most efficient load job I've ever done, but it works. Do you know if you just kick at the bottom of the door, it opens and closes? Now you do. I'm sorry, buddy. We can't take you on this trip. I know you want to go. I almost forgot. I want to take a hoodie with me. Going in a little different this weekend. No hat, just fresh haircuts. Ladies, if you're tired of your man smelling like Axe, this fear nothing my wife got me. She really likes the scent of it. It's from American Eagle. Maybe you could check it out. And if he's into the body spray stuff, maybe this one won't be as bad. Let's head out of here. This is like a three hour car ride, so you have to have car snacks. I did bring the crunchy peanut butter clip bar. I used to think that they were like uh, filled with dates. They're not, they're really good. You should check these things out. They're a little expensive, but 260 calories for that bar is pretty filling. And I've cursed the Diet Coke. Probably still have to stop for other things. Yeah. See, McDonald's knows the tricks. They give you a medium fry and a large thing, and then they paint the fries on on the back to make it look like you got a large fry. So my wife tells me after work, I've never actually had a Big Mac. Well, I ordered a Big Mac, <laughs> and she told me she wanted a quarter pounder. She said she'll try a bite of it, but this is what she wants right here. So why are you going to take a bite of this Big Mac? To get everyone to shut up about it. <laughs> <laughs> I had a mega viral video, and everybody's like, you can't believe she's never had a Big I've Mac. I've never had one. Never. I get stuck in a rut. Apparently like, you're a liar. You need to repent. I like what I like. All right. Yeah, I she likes I'll quarter pounders and fresh guess. meat. It's me taking a bite of a Big Mac. It's okay. Yeah. Would you go back to it if you had to choose to that quarter pounder? No. One of the coolest parts of our Chrysler Specifica is it comes with a vacuum built in. So after you get your car seat and the kids out, you can go through and clean up real quick to make it look like you got everything together and your life's not falling apart. Just look at all that extra room from putting those two seats down. It's crazy. Just getting rid of three kids does a lot for you. Onward to the Blue Gate Garden. I always forget what pump I'm on. Three? Three. I can't believe gas is four bucks a gallon up here. Oh, inside it's at four bucks. I hear it says 360. It's still way too much. We're here! This is nice. There's plenty of attractions here, but the biggest one is the Blue Gate restaurants. Get back in there. This is nice. You got a whole room for activity with a kitchenette complete with a microwave. You can make ramen noodles in there. The people throwing this even left me a basket. Ooh. This right here is the glacier water. It's the highest quality H2O they provide. You drink this, it's like the Eskimos. Okay? You just can't beat the Eskimo warrior. All right, let's go eat. I know we went to marriage retreat, but we had to bring the baby. Hey, man, you know, being Pentecostal, you kind of blend in in Amish country. You know, they're going to think you're a native or something. Yeah, these, the skirt. these stripes really scream Amish. There it is in all its glory. The baby. Hi, baby. Blue Gate Music Hall. Yeah, there's a little room here. This little. Ooh Let's get it. This is the line where Keto came to die. I made it out without getting my fingers bit. She's got chocolate, <laughs> peanut butter, <laughs> and then she gave me her cherry. Hey, aren't you a diabetic? I'm not eating them all. I'm that's where our marriage retreat deal is going to be. Look at all them buggies. Even the iron chariots here. That, uh, we want to, just brothers. Oh, I'm sorry. Is on your forehead? What happened? You get I'm, beat up? I'm abused. I think that's the same buggy from Little House on oh, the Prairie. Thank you very much. Back at the Amish Blue Hilton Garden Inn. Back at it tomorrow. And the other night I read the second chapter of life and wakes up my candle like people really care what I'm reading anyway. <laughs> Vlog.